Okay, so module seven is all about group hypnosis for stopping smoking. Now, the most effective way that I found to help groups of people to stop smoking is to actually do it in two sessions. So some hypnotherapists, when they're working with groups, will do one powerful session in the same way as they might do the same one for a one-to-one -one client. But the most effective way, and this has a 95% success rate, is to do two sessions. So the first session is going to be a cut down session where the client is cutting down to, or the group are cutting down to half of what they're smoking already. So if they're smoking 20 cigarettes a day, then you would um, put the suggestions into that first group session that they're only going to smoke 10 a day. Now, it's imperative with smoking and really with all group hypnosis that not only do the clients book beforehand, but they also pay in advance as well. And this is really imperatively important when it comes to stop smoking hypnosis. They must have the commitment. Again, the session or the group sessions can't be booked by somebody else. It has to be the client that wants to go ahead and do this. So the first session, you are going to cut the group down to half of what they were smoking. Now, obviously, everybody is going to have different amounts that they smoke. Some might be 20, some might be 30, some might be 10 or five cigarettes a day. So you're going to put in a generic um, suggestion within the first session that they will cut down very easily to half of the amount that they've been smoking. So you'll notice this first recording, which is the cut down smoking session, is about 20 minutes long. The second one is a final session, um, and that's the one that I'll talk to you after this cut down smoking session. Enjoy that. Hello and welcome to this self-hypnosis CD for stopping smoking. This CD has been professionally recorded for you by Karen E. Wells, a clinical hypnotherapist. All material on this CD is copyright to Karen E. Wells, 2009. And this track on this CD, which is track number two, is the first session that you will listen to. This track is a cut down session, which means that you will cut down for a week to half of the amount of cigarettes that you used to smoke before. And track number three on this CD, which is your second session, will be your final stop smoking session. So for the best results, it's best if you listen to this track, track number two, your cut down session, once a day for seven days. After seven days, you will then proceed to the stop session. And please note that this CD is not to be listened to in a moving vehicle. So first of all, you should close your eyes whilst finding yourself somewhere comfortable on a chair or sofa to begin to relax and let go.
you need to be somewhere where you can be undisturbed. So as you're now in that comfortable place and your eyes closed, let's begin this session by you just starting to take some nice, gentle, deep breaths. And these breaths are just really to your own level of comfort. And as you're taking those deep breaths, I want you to invite your mind to really just begin to watch your breathing. And so really all that's happening is your mind is watching your breath. Inhale and exhale. So almost at this point that you're inhaling peace and relaxation. And you're simply just exhaling any tension, any tightness, and you're just beginning to relax and let go. And you can allow that breath to return to normal now, knowing that as you do, each breath is just taking you into a nice level of relaxation. And any sounds that you hear, which is my voice, the melody of this beautiful music. Any sounds inside or outside your room again are just going to relax you deeper and deeper. So I want you now to begin to imagine that there's just a nice deep wave of relaxation that's beginning to just work through your mind and body. So you can maybe begin to imagine that wave of relaxation as maybe your favorite color so you can watch that working through your body. Or if not, you can just sense it happening or just trust that it is either way is fine. So this wave of relaxation is beginning now to just come through the forehead and down into those thousands of tiny muscles in the cheeks. It continues as it moves down the back of your neck and doubles and deepens now as it goes right down to the base of your spine. You can really begin to feel this wave of relaxation as it moves out into every cell, every muscle, every fiber of your back taking you now twice as deep, twice as relaxed. It increases as it works over your chest and tummy and across the shoulder blades, down the arms and all the way to the tips of your fingers. And at some point you may just feel slight tingling in the fingertips or just a warmth in the palm of your hands. And if you do, then that's absolutely fine. It's just a sign of tension leaving your body and mind. So 
So it continues to increase as it works now through the hips, the legs, the knees and all the way right down through your calves to the very tips of your toes, taking you again twice as deep, twice as relaxed. In fact, you feel that wave of relaxation continue as it works from the tips of your toes to the top of your head and all the way down again and continues working for the rest of this session. So I want you now to become very aware of what's supporting your body. The chair, the sofa. But it's almost now that with each breath you can really feel that support and really begin to just let go now, whether you're consciously aware of that or not. You're letting go and really sinking down into that support and you're just relaxing even deeper as you do. So I want you to imagine now that there's a beautiful staircase in the sky and that staircase has got 10 wonderful steps leading right now down to your perfect place of relaxation. In a moment, I'm going to start to count you down those steps and with each and every step, that you take down that staircase. You'll find yourself just easily, naturally, becoming 10 times more deeper relaxed with each step. Becoming 10 times more deeper relaxed with each step. So standing on that top step now and taking that first Step down, 10, 9, relaxing deeper and deeper, 8, 7, beginning to feel now 10 times more deeper relaxed, 6, 5, relaxing more and more. Four, three, two, and one deeper and deeper relaxed. And you find yourself now in your special place of relaxation. And this can be anywhere that you want to be right now but you feel so safe, so secure, and so wonderfully relaxed. And the temperature for you is just perfect. You allow yourself to remain at this level of relaxation. And in fact, each and every time, you choose to listen to a recording, you will find that you go into an even deeper state of relaxation, where each and all of my words will just become more and more embedded into your mind, more and more relevant, as you now continue to just relax and let go, knowing that in your special place, there's absolutely nothing that you need to do, but simply relax. 
And as you do, know that this is the time that you have decided to become a non-smoker. And this is the time that you will succeed. Over the years, your mind and your body have learnt the habit of smoking. In fact, they've learnt it very well. And that's made you a good smoker. But now, because it's what you want, because it's what you choose, your mind, your body, are now willing to learn to accept and adopt a new, better habit. And that's a habit of being a calm, contented, relaxed, satisfied, healthier, and richer non-smoker. And remember that this is the only body that you've got and it's got to last you your lifetime. So care enough about yourself, care enough about your health, and care enough now about your future to succeed, and care enough to become and remain a calm, contented, relaxed, satisfied, healthier, richer and fitter non-smoker. And now that you will be a non-smoker, think about what your health means to your family, to those closest to you. What it will be like for you to be able to breathe clearly. No longer coughing, but finally feeling healthy. And what it means to you to have those extra finances. And imagine what it's going to be like when you can enjoy long walks, exercise, and how well and healthy you're going to be. And because you're so determined to succeed, between now and for the next seven days, you will be able to reduce your number of cigarettes easily to half the amount that you used to smoke. And knowing that by doing so, this is going to be much, much easier than you've ever imagined. To become and remain what you've chosen to be and what you will be, a calm, contented, relaxed, satisfied, healthier, richer and fitter non-smoker. So between now and seven days, for the next seven days you're going to easily be able to reduce your number of cigarettes to half what you used to smoke. And this is the time that you will succeed. Feel it, Know it, believe it. This is the time that you will succeed. Feel it, know it, believe it. Because this is the time that you will succeed. Feel it, know it, believe it. This is the absolute time that you will succeed. Feel it, know it, believe it. 
This is the time that you will succeed. Feel it, know it, believe it. And when you listen to that next track in seven days, or however many days you've got until that week's passed, and I use the words, close your eyes, you will find that you drift automatically into this deep, deep relaxation, even deeper than you feel right now, where my words, my suggestions, will have the greatest effect, helping you to be as you've chosen to be, and as you will be a non-smoker. So now on the count of 10, you'll awaken feeling so confident, so determined, so optimistic. This feeling stays with you, working with you, working for you. And this is the time that you will succeed. Feel it, know it, believe it. So one, two, three, just any images, any scenes, just fading away now. Four, five, six, slowly, very slowly coming back to the room. Seven, eight, and nine, hearing my words. And 10 now opening your eyes, feeling very relaxed, very confident, very determined and very optimistic. Okay, so the second track in module seven is the actual stop smoking session. So they've come back to your group hypnosis session for the second week, the second session. They've cut down half of what they were smoking before and some clients, most of them within that group will have managed to do it. You'll have some people that didn't or managed to on some days in that week, but maybe not at the weekend, it doesn't matter you've got to have complete trust that they are going to be able to do it and they will so they've now come back for that final stop smoking session this session is just under 25 minutes long and again you're going to give them recordings of both of these now once they've done that final session with you um, as a group live session they from that point are then total non-smokers they must have that belief. Now, the session that you're going to do with them, you're going to give them as a recording, and then they would listen to that recording at least once a day for the next two weeks. If they need to listen to it longer, then that's fine. Obviously, because they've stopped smoking at this point after the second live session, they're not going to listen to the cut down smoking session. So it's now just the focus is on this final stop smoking session and then they'll have that recording to listen to. As I say, this way with two sessions, it's a 95% success rate. I found that anybody in that other 5% are simply just not ready to give up smoking. So again, get the group um, to really come up with suggestions of what they don't like about stop smoke about smoking this is where the only way really that i would bring in any aversion therapy because you're going to make the sessions as disgusting as absolutely possible and the more disgusting that they are the more aversion they're going to have to smoke um, cigarettes and it works very very powerful they might also have other me family members that are close to them that may have suffered from smoke relating um, illnesses and that's okay again you can bring a suggestion in that if they know anybody this is just going to motivate them to stay not smoking so listen to the induction the deepener and then you'll be able to hear the suggestions that i'm giving to the group once you've listened to that we'll see you on the next module have a great day
Hello and welcome to the second track on this self-hypnosis CD for stopping smoking. This CD has been professionally recorded for you by Karen E. Wells, a clinical hypnotherapist. All material on this CD is copyright to Karen E. Wells, 2009. This is track two, which is the stop session in your stop smoking program. Which means that for the last seven days, you will have listened to the previous track and will have cut down to approximately half of the cigarettes that you used to smoke. So you're now ready to finally give up smoking. So again, making yourself very comfortable. Being in a room where you're not going to be disturbed. so that you can really begin to relax and let go. Remembering that this CD is not to be used in a moving vehicle. So you're just somewhere where you can relax and let go now as you close your eyes and begin to drift into a nice level of relaxation. Starting once again by taking some nice deep breaths for me just to your own level of comfort and bringing the mind to watch the in-breath and the out-breath and that's all you're doing watching the inflow and the outflow of your breath allowing each breath to relax you deeper and deeper And any sounds that you're hearing, my voice, the music, any sounds inside or outside your room, again are just going to take you to another level of relaxation. And so allowing that breathing to return to normal now. as we begin to watch, feel or sense that wave of relaxation working through the body. You feel it working now through the forehead and down into those thousands of tiny muscles and your face. Feeling it continue as it moves down the back of your neck and all the way down, right down to the base of your spine. It increases as it moves out into every cell, every fiber, every muscle of your back, relaxing releasing, just letting go. That deep wave of relaxation continues as it goes over your chest and tummy, right across the shoulder blades, 
and right down your arms to the tips of your fingers. Once again feeling at some point that tingling or just a feeling of warmth in the palm of your hands as tension leaves your mind and your body. It continues on as it works through the hips, down through the legs, the knees, the calves and all the way to the tips of your toes, taking you just twice as deep, twice as relaxed. feeling that wave of relaxation as it moves down and up from the toes to the head and right back down to the toes again and you allow yourself to remain at this level of relaxation. You begin to feel the support that's underneath your body. And now with each breath, it's almost that you begin to let go. And each breath takes you into that support, letting you let go and allowing you to just relax. So I want you now to begin to imagine once again that staircase that's got those 10 beautiful steps that are leading all the way down to your place of perfect relaxation. So I'll begin to count you down those steps and with each and every step that you take down, you're going to find that you easily, naturally, become 20 times more deeper relaxed than you were previously. Each step taking you 20 times more deeper relaxed. So standing on that top step and taking that first step down. 10, nine, Relaxing deeper and deeper. Eight. Seven, beginning to feel now 20 times more deeper relaxed than you were previously. Six. Five, relaxing more and more as you continue down. Four. Three. Two. And one, deeper and deeper relaxed. So you feel yourself now at one of the deepest levels of relaxation that you've ever been at. And that level of relaxation allows each word that I say to you to become firmly embedded into your mind and allows you to be able to achieve the goal that you want to achieve. But you find yourself now in that perfect place of relaxation for you. The temperature is just right. And you feel so safe, so relaxed, so secure and there's nothing that you need to do but simply just relax and let go just relax so over the last seven days You've done really well in your efforts to become a non-smoker. 
At times you may have found it difficult. At times you may have been tempted, but you did it. And that was the hard part. That was the difficult part. But now that's behind you. So now in every day, in every way, being a non-smoker for you becomes easier and easier. Because now you can really enjoy being a non-smoker. Your mind and your body becoming accustomed to this wonderful new experience. A non-smoker. Hour by hour, day by day feeling so pleased to be a non-smoker and so proud of your achievement. And how wonderful for you now to be able to say, no thanks, I don't smoke. How good that sounds, how good it feels. And tonight, when you go to sleep, you will have a wonderful dream. In this dream, you will be a non-smoker, living your life as a non-smoker. And this dream will be so wonderful and so real that when you wake up, you will feel like a non-smoker. And it will be as though it's been weeks and weeks since you last had a cigarette and how wonderful that feels. So now with your mind's eye, your imagination, using that part of your mind where dreams are made, where thoughts become pictures and those pictures for you become a reality. Using that part of your mind Imagine, pretend that you're in a lovely place in nature. And this could be a place that you know and could be somewhere imaginary, but it's such a lovely place. Let it be a lovely day with warm sunshine, a perfect blue sky and a gentle breeze. Just be there and enjoy this time. Nothing to rush for. Nothing waiting to be done. Just your time, your place. It's as though nothing could destroy this peace and tranquility. But as you look around, you notice that nearby there's a huge pile of rubbish that's just been dumped. So ugly, spoiling the scenery and spoiling your day. But because you care, you go closer to investigate. And as you get closer, you're amazed to see that there's a signpost by the rubbish. It has your name on it. It states that the rubbish is yours and that you're responsible. And you wonder how could this be? But as you look, it's true. Because you're now a non-smoker Every cigarette that you've ever smoked has been collected and dumped there. The flat ones you've put your foot on, the ones you've stubbed out in ashtrays. In fact, the first one, the last one, and every single one in between a hill of cigarettes. As you get closer, you can smell them. Stale, 
pungent, dirty. Can you calculate how much money that represents to you? Hundreds, thousands of pounds. Each and every one a poison to your body. But what's really sad is the fact that all these cigarettes were once a part of nature. The tobacco was a leaf. Even the paper came from nature. But because you're now a non-smoker, what I want you to do is return these cigarettes back to nature, where they belong. So with your mind's eye, with your imagination, you see yourself setting fire to this hill of cigarettes, seeing the smoke beginning to spiral, the flames burning brighter, stronger, fiercer, hotter. Maybe even taking a stick and poking and prodding, turning the pile so that the first one, the last one, and every single one in between is consumed by that fire. Watch them go and be glad. A wonderful sense of relief and satisfaction for you. But as that fire burns down to fluffy ash, the breeze begins to scatter the ash. The ash fertilizes the earth. And here in this charred and scorched place, the breeze deposits seeds, the rains fall, the sun shines, and in no time at all new plants grow. And this place will have returned to its former beauty. The richer, the better for what you've done. But what's even more wonderful is the fact that even now nature is at work, work within your body. Even now blocked airways are being eased open, damaged tissue being repaired and destroyed cells being renewed. And in no time at all, your body will be as though you've never had a cigarette in your life. You've done it, and how good that feels. You've tidied it all up, sorted it out. It's over, done with, it's all behind you. And as you walk away now, there's no regrets, none. There's just a wonderful sense of pride and satisfaction of how good it feels for you now as a non-smoker. As you walk away, you find yourself walking by a crystal clear sparkling stream. Sunlight dapples the water. Water dances over the stones. You find the need to stoop down and to wash your hands in that cool running water, washing away the smell of smoke, washing away the stain of nicotine, but most of all, best of all, washing your hands of the habit you used to have of smoking. You've done it, enjoy it. Enjoy being a non-smoker, as every day in every way this now gets easier and easier for you. You are now a non-smoker, and how good that feels. You are now a non-smoker, and how good that feels. You're now a non-smoker. How good that feels.
You've done it. Enjoy it. Enjoy being a non-smoker, as every day in every way for you, it gets easier and easier. And now on the count of 10, when I get to 10 and at that point only, you will then awaken a non-smoker. You will remain a non-smoker. And how good that feels. You will never ever have the urge for, the cig for a cigarette again. You will never ever smoke in any of the places that you used to smoke. You will never ever smoke with any of the people that you used to smoke with. Because you're now a non-smoker and you will awaken a non-smoker and you will remain a non-smoker and how good that feels. So one, two and three, just letting all of those scenes fade away. Four, five, six, slowly coming back to the room. Seven, eight and nine, nearly there. And 10 now awakening. Feels so, so positive, so confident so relaxed.